Former FTX chief Sam Bankman-Fried has appealed a judge's decision to allow the identities of the two currently unidentified people who co-signed his $250 million bail bond to be made public, according to a filing made on Tuesday. It was already known that Bankman-Fried's parents also co-signed the bond, but the other names were kept private. U.S. District Judge Lewis Kaplan ruled early last week in favour of four separate petitions by a number of news organisations seeking the names of these individuals who signed onto the bond earlier this month. Now that an appeal has been filed, Kaplan's ruling has been stayed until at least February 14. U.S. prosecutors have asked the fraud cases against FTX founder Sam Bankman-Fried not proceed until the conclusion of government's criminal case against him, according to court documents. Damian Williams, the main prosecutor overseeing the criminal case against Bankman-Fried, wrote that the Commodities Future Trading Commission and the Securities and Exchange Commission had both consented to the stay. Bankman-Fried, former Alameda Research CEO Caroline Ellison and FTX co-founder Gary Wang have also agreed to stay, according to the court filing. The outcome of the criminal case will likely have a significant impact on the civil cases, he said in the Tuesday court filing. Williams also said he was concerned Bankman-Fried's legal team could use the civil case's discovery process to bolster its defence in the criminal case. The SEC has charged Bankman Freed with scheming to defraud FTX investors. Meanwhile, the CFTC charged Bankman Freed, FTX, and Alameda Research with fraud and material misrepresentations. Several cryptocurrency companies, including Binance, Tether, Bitfinex, OKX, and Qcoin, have pledged over $9 million in donations to aid the victims of massive earthquakes that hit Turkey and Syria early Monday morning. As the number of casualties continues to rise, more than 7,000 killed and over 20,000 injured, the collective effort demonstrates that the crypto community is again ready to step, step up to support humanitarian efforts. Joining in the fundraising efforts, Avalanche Foundation donated $1 million in AVAX tokens. Time to take care of our users, CZ tweeted, adding that the crypto exchange would airdrop $100 in BNB, totaling $5 million to users in the region. Soon after news broke of the earthquake and the staggering number of lives lost, Bitfinex, Keith Synonym, Tether and other companies announced a collective pledge of 5 million Turkish lira, around $266,000, to go towards the earthquake recovery effort. Tron founder Justin Sun also pledged to donate $1 million in TRX from the Ubuy Global Cryptocurrency Exchange. That's all in the news today. This is me, Vishakha, signing off. For more such updates, keep watching 3.0 TV. Do like, share and subscribe to our channel.